Many people believe that Buddhism is a comforting, peace-giving religion. They even imagine that it represents a solution to many problems. This, however, is a great error. Because that which Buddhism regards as a virtue consists of suffering. For that reason, this religion pushes people towards a life full of suffering and poverty. Eating the best foods and being clean and comfortable are forbidden in Buddhism. For Buddhist monks and nuns, life is full of all kinds of difficulties. They are forbidden to work. They feed themselves by going from door to door and begging among the people. For this reason, Buddhist priests are even called bhikkhus, which means beggars by the people. This is a most humiliating position. Buddhist priests are forbidden to marry or have any kind of family life. They may own only one robe. They eat only one meal a day. And they must finish this before noon. This meal generally consists of bread and rice flavored with spices. It is forbidden to eat such things as meat or fruit. In short, Buddhist strictures are a form of self-torture. Islam, on the other hand, wishes people to take advantage of the good things of the world and forbids them to inflict suffering on themselves. Islam offers a peaceful life aimed at winning the good pleasure of God. People who live by the moral values of the Quran are clean, take pleasure from life, and are always animated, joyful and happy. This is what God reveals concerning those who, like Buddhists, inflict suffering on themselves. God does not wrong people in any way. Rather, it is people who wrong themselves. 